Red Cloud, mm -hmm. faithful paw, <laughs> you have shown great courage. You ate the nasty giant caterpillar. Oh. You retrieved an egg from the nest of the black eagle. Oh, and yeah. you rid the prairie coyote of ticks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Therefore, I appoint you a warrior, faithful paw. Yeah! <laughs> woo, 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 ha! Um, <laughs> wise raccoon, what about me? I'm sorry, Red Cloud. I spoke with the great Manitou last night. Huh? And he wants to test your courage one more time. What? Another test of courage? You must win a girl's heart. A what? A what? A girl's what? heart? But girls are trouble. Oh. Not just any girl's heart. The heart of Bright Feather. Wise Raccoon, please beg the great Manitou for mercy. Wise Raccoon has spoken. Take it from me, there are two kinds of people who can easily be won over with gold. Bandits and girls. You know what, Gene? I won't be working my guts out in this lousy gold mine forever. <laughs> well, someday soon I'll have my own jeans factory. And where will you find the money for that? <laughs> I started saving up a while ago. Hmm. <laughs> wow, look at that. The magic powder. Yeah. They use it to blast holes in the rocks. Uh, 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 I want to check out the lay of the land. Uh, 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 uh. Let's go. Yeah. Goodbye. The gold mine is ours. <laughs> oh, hey, yeah, 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 hey, yeah. <laughs> Faithful Paw, look at that. Oh, a huge nugget of gold. <laughs> right Feather will be amazed. Oh, even more magic powder. Oh, Faithful Paw, let's go. Just a second. It must have something to do with fire. Hmm. Oh, whoa! <gasps> whoa! Faithful Paw! Oh. 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 This stuff is incredible! <laughs> oh. Why on earth does Bright Feather have to be the chief's daughter? Take it like a warrior, my brother. Hey, greetings, Chief Sharptaw. I come bearing a gift for Bright Feather. A gift for me? Go on, Red Cloud. <laughs> Bright Feather. To me, you are as lovely as uh, this nugget of gold. You give me a stone and tell me I look like a boulder? You've lost your mind! <laughs> <laughs> She's just like Chief Sharpclaw. I think it's time for Plan B. <sighs> These guys look pretty mean. Just wait. When they see the gold, they'll be eating out of the palm of our hand. Is that clear? Pinch me. <laughs> what do we have here? Seems like two natives looking for trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Greetings, Bennett. Stop! <laughs> Give me one reason not to blow those feathers right off your head. Here. A large golden nugget. What? Gold? And you'll get another one as soon as you've helped me with my plan. Open up a can of beans. We have guests. <laughs> okay, let me spell it out. Bright Feather goes for a walk near the frontier every afternoon. Uh -huh, yeah. You ride towards her and pretend you're going to rob her. Uh -huh. Yeah, I like it. And then I come riding in on my proud horse, swing my tomahawk, mm -hmm. and chase you away. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> this little one would make a really good bandit. <laughs> oh, a vulture. Oh, how cute. Hi. 
<laughs> and then she'll think you are the bravest warrior she has ever laid her eyes on. Oh, there are the bandits. Walking alone in the prairie. <laughs> Go away, <laughs> Come on, show them. My father's gonna get you for this and feed you to the vultures. You girl! I'm ah. dead. So now you're all scared, huh? <clears throat> Holy tomahawk! What are they doing here? Ah. <clears throat> Milady, I am sorry, but uh, feeding wildlife is prohibited. <laughs> you need to come with us. Uh, you can't be serious! Uh, stop I just wiggling and jumping about! Now calm uh. down, please. Let me go immediately! Hey, Arthur, what? who'd you got there? I have a captive. She was caught feeding the wild. Well, then, welcome to Fort Bray. Let me out of here! Oh, if they harm even one hair on Bright Feather's head, then, then, Sharp Claw will harm ours. <laughs> Paper Ball, what do you want with the magic powder? What do you want with the beaver? Come on, beaver. Choose your way through. Red Cloud! Come here! Get here! I'm here, you silly fellow! Ha! Who do we have here? Don't move! And put the tomahawk on the ground slowly. They've got Red Cloud. Hold on, George! It's time for the big attack! The natives are attacking! The natives? Colonel, it came from there! We're surrounded! Climb onto the balustrade! Up onto the balustrade! Up onto the balustrade! <laughs> They're hiding to shoot! Yeah, they're home! <laughs> you stop! Get back! But, 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 you can't! Red Cloud at last! Right, Feather, don't be afraid! I'm not afraid! Quick, this way! <laughs> Red Cloud, you did not succeed in winning Bright Feather's heart. I'm so out of his league. But I hereby declare you a warrior anyway. Huh? But why's Raccoon Why? How could that be? I had another discussion last night with Great Manitou. He says I should make you a warrior before you and Faithful Paw stir up even more trouble. <laughs> Ooh, two vultures. Alexandria. I can already smell the desert from here. Um, I'm sorry. Oh, Caesar, as much as I'd like to go to shore, I do have to go back to Rome. Uh, could you let me jump out? I mean, if it isn't too much trouble. Um, I'm not trying to chicken out. Unfortunately, I forgot my travel papyrus. You're barely two weeks in the Legion, and you're already showing fear. Do you propose that we ask 
for permission before we finish the Egyptians? Today we are not here for a battle, Rufus. Instead, we come here in peace. So, no travel, Papyrus Probatus? Your Papyrus ID is sufficient. The borders are open. Now, pull yourself together, boy. Shoulders back, chest out, nose to the wind, and look straight ahead. By the gods, soon your fears will disappear. Land! Land in sight! They're coming, mistress. The Romans are here. Finally, our meeting will secure the peace between Rome and Egypt. Certainly, Cleopatra. Caesar shall ah! attack. What's going on? To the weapons! Oh, no. Spread out! Prepare to attack! No! Ah. Ptolemaios, no! Huh? What's this about, Pharaoh? The <clears throat> Romans are not attacking. They come in peace. That's what you think, my sister. I say they want war. But, but we both rule Egypt. You can't just order the attack. I can't? Open fire! No! They will give us a triumphant welcome. Wouldn't you agree, Marcus? Indeed, Caesar. I'm sorry, but that doesn't look like welcome fireworks. Take cover! Take formation! <laughs> Shall we return fire, Caesar? No. Yes, but only fire once. Fire! This was a terrible misunderstanding. Forgive us, great Caesar, and welcome to Egypt. Cleopatra. <laughs> We're building a stage for a friendship feast. <laughs> Maybe I'll stay a little longer. Yes, a feast. But if you keep taking your time, then... <laughs> How clumsy of me. Rome and Egypt make peace, Pharaoh. Your sister has shown great courage when she opposed Caesar during the attack. Yes, the people think of her as the better leader. You and your people need to prevent this peace treaty, Hakim. But how, Pharaoh? Our army now follows Cleopatra. No one will want to fight against the Romans unless... Unless? <clears throat> Unless we unleash the plagues from the Anubis Shrine in the Pyramid. The plagues? B but if we unleash the plagues, it will lead to disaster. Terrible hailstorms and locusts will ravage the land. That's correct, Pharaoh. And the people will see it as a sign of the misery that Rome has brought upon them. Cleopatra would be ruined, and then I could rule Egypt alone. Go to the pyramid and unleash the plagues. After all, we're doing it for me, um, for Egypt. Indeed, Pharaoh. <laughs> this isn't good. Not good at all. By Jupiter. We will be at war if we don't defeat your brother's plan. And I know just the right person for the job. Tomb Raiders? Find the three plagues? I don't know what this has to do with me. I shouldn't even be here. Perhaps we should call it a day and go back to Rome. Perhaps Caesar will feed you to the lions. The lions? <sighs> well, I guess Caesar likes you because you gave us warning of the attack on the ship. But it was just luck. I don't know anything. Clearly, Probatus Maximus. We must turn back and explain that to Caesar. Quiet and move on. Orders are ordered. <laughs> Didn't I say move on? The pyramid. Wow. Here it does not go any further. Are you sure the map is correct? Um, I... Uh, this way should be correct. It's about time. We'll catch them before they find the plagues. Catch them? But there are three of them. So what? <laughs> Mm. There you go. Ah! Samira! No! 
Romans! Just you wait! Let's catch them! What now? Do we fight? Um, uh, later! First, we strategically retreat! Meaning? Uh, Meaning run! Uh, 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 hurry up! Move it! <laughs> I think we lost them. Hey, you see that? There's Anubis, and these must be the plagues. We're in the right place. There must be a secret passage here. Well, even if there was a secret passage, this is the newest Egyptian pyramid technology. How do you suppose we find it, little know-it-all? Did you hear that? Ooh. I thought you didn't know your way around here. <laughs> No big jars with the plagues. Ha! Beware, Romans. Did you really think you could snatch the three plagues away from us? I told you, Grandpa. These aren't flower vases. We need to find a different souvenir for Grandma. Our apologies, noble tomb raiders. My grandpa is a little confused. What? What are you talking about, Greenhorn? I could pass as your dad. Now, now, grandpa, it's been a long day. That's enough! I'm not your grandpa! I'm the centurion in this <laughs> man! That was awesome, Marcus. I almost thought you were really mad at me. Um, uh, yes. So did I, uh, almost. Ha! <laughs> Let's get out of here! Hurry! After them! Wait! No, I don't believe it! Hurry up! Red flag is being hoisted. That means... I know what it means, fool! By Anubis. Hakim failed. The feast will happen. Or maybe not. <clears throat> I think this is ah. still... Attack on Caesar's tent! Legionnaires, take formation! Ah. Go faster! Ow. They're on our tail! Look! Ah. No, don't look! And which way is the palace? This way! Stop! Stop, stop, stop! Stop! Too late! Take cover! Ah. <laughs> Wow, that was close! Through here! You fools! Stop it! Lower your weapons! This is my brother's doing. I said stop! That's an order! Stop! Stop at once! The Egyptians are our friends. We are not here to fight, but to celebrate this new friendship. <laughs> but how can we be certain that we can trust them? We know it because... because... <laughs> because we offer you a drink. A drink to our friendship. Long live Cleopatra! <laughs> All right, well, can I get you something to drink? <laughs> Are these the ones? The plagues? Yes, Caesar. And may I suggest keeping them in a safe place? Guards? Well, I have to say, you were quite a big help with my mission. Are you surprised? <laughs> After all, I am your lucky charm. <laughs> you must be joking. <laughs> oh. Shoot Caesar! Now! Really? But your royal sister said that... Uh, your face... Your face is so no. lovely, my dear. Take 
take him. Ah. But, 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 I didn't mean it. It was an accident. Not bad, Grandpa. Grandpa, don't be so bold, <laughs> youngster. To you, I'm still Mr. Centurion. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else, anyone? Some soup, perhaps? No? No one? <sighs> huh? Come here now. Father? Come on already. Father? Oh, ha! I've got you now. Look, son, another onion. Ooh, not the freshest. But at least some onion is better than no onion, right? No, Rush Father. There's no one here to order the soup anyway. Hmm. Huh? So attacking! Warning! Be more than 20 years now. Hmm. Where'd they go? I think they went that way. <laughs> Let's see if the old fisherman was lying just before I threw him overboard. <laughs> but Cal the Calamari even told him the hiding place. Yeah, that wasn't right what the captain did. Huh? Huh? What? <laughs> Eternal wealth for me, Big Jack Silver! <laughs> what is that awful stench? <laughs> Did you cook that, you lout? You are in luck, Mr. Pirate. The lunch menu is still in effect for another ten minutes. Buy one large soup and get a big jug of rhubarb juice for free. He's seen too much already. We're gonna uh, take him uh, with us. Uh, uh, rhubarb soda is okay, too. Mm. A new cook? I can taste it now. He's not going in the galley, you nitwits. He's gonna be swabbing the deck. Cast off! The red coats. And fire. Hard to starboard, lads. Peter, there he is. Good. We're getting away. I don't think you need me, so I'm just gonna. Where do you think you're going? Hey, would you watch out? You're a girl. Oh, clever. What are you doing here? Can't you tell? Waiting till Uncle Silver lets me out of here again. Wait, that pirate jerk is your uncle? Hey, uh, watch what you say about my family. What? That jerk came and stole our treasure map. I can say what I want. That's what pirates do, you landlubber. We steal treasures and treasure maps. Ow! Ugh. Too bad I wasn't there. Yeah, that's because your wonderful uncle locked you up. Yeah, but only because I wanted to help the guy he threw overboard. Was it Calamari? Oh. <gasps> Ghost pirate on the port side! Ghost pirates? <laughs> oh boy, can it get worse? Everyone on deck! Let me through me! Oh, 
can see better on the other side. What's happening? <clears throat> Ahoy, comrade! Where are you heading? I am Captain Black, and I was cursed. Why? Oh, that is unfortunate indeed. But I'm afraid we cannot help you there. Am I right, man? Oh. I was told that you are looking for a treasure, Jack Silver. Looking for my treasure. Oh, uh, well, uh, that hat looks good on you, sir. Uh, where can I get one like it? Hmm. Calm down. I don't want to hinder your search. I'll even give you my treasure as a gift. Oh, really? For only when I find someone who will hold this magic map while standing on the treasure stone and willingly accept their fate to live as a ghost, will I be set free from this wretched curse. And whomever finds that volunteer will own my treasure. Here's the volunteer you asked for. Hmm. Ah. Well, he'll do. What? Hmm. Hold on. Peter. Now then, to the treasure island. Psst. Hey, Peter. Up here. Huh. Here. This is for you. The treasure map. Did you steal it from your uncle? Well, actually, it belongs to you. Wow. So I can find the treasure now. Shh. Come on, you have to leave. What? Shoot. Oh, it's okay. What? All set? Yeah, we can go. Uh-huh. Good. You'll help me. We're not doing this just for you. It's just self-interest, boy. You think we want to sail with that ghost? <laughs> no, you. Go, jump! And you? Jump, quick! What's going on here? Hey! Jump! <laughs> uh, uh. Imagine that! <laughs> My own niece betrays me! <sighs> what is that? I can't believe it. What? Oh, drown me now. It's the treasure island. And how exactly would you know that? He's right. Look over there. Quick, paddle. If the captain catches us, he'll throw us overboard. Oh, 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 here, for you, matey. A lucky charm. Our pirate's badge. Now you're a real pirate. <laughs> Land lover. <laughs> Swaggy. Hey, let go of me, you musty old pirate. Well, little niece, you freed my volunteer, so you will have to take his place. Well, you must all make sacrifices for the family. <laughs> Just wait till I look as scary as Mr. Black here. You won't be laughing then. She doesn't mean it, Mr. Ghost Captain. <laughs> I must find the treasure before they do. <sighs> Where watch is held by Joe the Bone, and water falls twice from the stone. Turn the button after you go in, you'll stand before the golden hey, well, bin. Well, looky here. <laughs> huh? Do you like fish? Oh, I... No fish? Fine, then you'll have to eat coconut. You can find them anywhere around here. <laughs> oh, well, I... It's okay. You don't have to eat now. You can just keep me company instead. I would love to, but I have to go find Joe the Bone. Joe the Bone? <laughs> don't worry, he won't run away. Huh? Why not? Because he's dead, boy. Joe the Bone was a pirate who rebelled against Captain Black. His bones are rotting close to the waterfalls. Waterfalls? Is it two waterfalls? The treasure map? Holy sailboat. Do you know where it is? I told you to let him go. <laughs>
Stand before the golden bin. Wow. Peter. Lucy. Peter. Land lover. Say your prayers, Skellywag! <laughs> I volunteer! <laughs> Who did that? Good night. So much going on today. Sorry, guys. I have three aces. Three aces? How is that possible? You're cheating, little lady. See that again, old man. Hey, be nice, you pirate lackeys. What? what? Uh, did he just call us lackeys? <laughs> <laughs> hey, the soup is on me. Huh? Soup? No way, boy! The people want fish, right? Yeah. Oh, me, 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 me first! Oh, me first! <laughs> it's too bad that your uncle's not with us. Uh, you don't have to worry about Uncle Silver. He always wished for others to shiver in his presence. And that's exactly what he got. <laughs> <laughs> 